Good afternoon. It's wonderful to be back here in the presence of Our Lady of the Hudson River. Um, Well-behaved women don't make history. I'm not sure who wrote that, but it's one of my all-time favorites, and it certainly holds true in our Jewish tradition. Two weeks ago, we celebrated Purim, the festival that lauds a woman, Queen Esther, who saved our people from destruction. And she didn't do it by being well-behaved. Two weeks from now, the spotlight shifts to three comparably rebellious women, the midwives, Shifra and Pua, and the prophet Miriam, without whom there would be no Passover and no Exodus. Shifra and Pua, you will recall, disobeyed the Pharaoh's order to kill all Hebrew baby boys. Miriam, determined to save her brother, conceived an illegal strategy involving a basket, a princess, and a wet nurse who happened to be her and Moses' mother. It's no exaggeration to say that without Shifra, Pua, and Miriam, there would be no Moses and no Jewish people. As I noted from this podium last year, most societies honor their live conformists and their dead troublemakers. JWA believes it's our job to honor our holy troublemakers while they're still around. Accordingly, I'm pleased to introduce three 21st century women who carry on in the tradi tradition of our brave foremothers and whom we're pleased to honor today. Belle Kaufman. Belle is very simply every woman's role model for how to live a life of purpose, energy, and meaning. She's amazing. Today I reached for her and said, I'm, I'm Letty Pogrim, and she said, I know who you are. <laughs> really kind of tough, strong, assertive woman. A New York City public school teacher for many years, starting in the 1930s. In 1965, Bell published Up the Down Staircase, a funny, ironic, best-selling novel, and eventually a wildly successful movie about the challenges of teaching in an urban high school. If you have never read it, you're in for a treat. And happily, Bell will be signing three of her books after lunch today. And by the way, this past summer, at the age of 102, she's on the cusp of her 103rd. No? She's 101 now on the cusp of 102. OK, I think Wikipedia had it wrong. <laughs> Belle taught a course on Jewish humor at Hunter College. Before we meet this amazing person, give or take a year or two. should all reach 101 and really care about the difference. <laughs> um, this video from our friends at Open Road Media will tell you more about her. 